This is CHS TV News. Good morning, Cathedral. I'm Rachel. And I'm Brianna with your morning announcements for Wednesday, October 12th. To start off our show, I'll pass it over to Bernard and Abby from your student council. Good morning, Gales. We are here to give you more about the Halloween dance that will take place on Wednesday, October 26th. sold until Tuesday, October 25th. Tickets are $7 or only $6 if you're bringing the food donation for the annex. If you want to bring a guest to the dance, you must fill out a guest application form. These are now available on the Student Council office doors and are due by next Wednesday. We have DJ Daniel Walton coming to provide us with some sick tunes. As well, there will be prizes rewarded for best costumes. This dance sells out every year, so you'll want to make sure you get your tickets as soon as possible. That's all from us. Now back to the anchors. Thanks guys. To all grade 12 students and potential graduates, there will be an assembly in the forum tomorrow during period two for all grade 12 classes. Particularly, this assembly is for all potential graduates and will address the calendar of events and dates and general information pertaining to graduation 2017. Prospective graduates and their parents can now also find these dates on our school website. Potential graduates who are not attending a grade 12 class during period two may, with the permission of their classroom teacher, attend the assembly in the forum as well. These students are expected to touch base with their period two teacher first, be marked present on the attendance card, and then return to class once the assembly has concluded. For further information, please contact Mrs. Tambasco or Mrs. Simpson. All pilgrimage permission forms are due tomorrow. Your pledge forms and money are not due until after the pilgrimage walk, the week of October 17th to the 21st. However, you can hand it in any time before that and at the registration table on the day of the pilgrimage, October 16th. And speaking of tomorrow, Ian Ford from St. Patrick's Church will be bringing the therapy dogs to Cathedral once a month, once a month this year. His first visit with Nesbitt and Bailey will be tomorrow during lunches in the forum. Look for the purple couch. This message is for all students who are interested in taking part in Halloween for Hunger this year. You must see one of the Halloween for Hunger Executive Committee members on your lunch to register your group. Students that signed up at Club Fair will also need to see a committee member to confirm their participation and to be placed into a group. All students are welcome to sign up as you will be placed in a group if you do not have one. Also, if you have a driver for your group, please let the Executive Committee know. Executive Committee members will be in the cafeteria on both lunches. All students are welcome to sign up for this awesome event where we trick or treat for food donations for the Annex. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Nicole or Mrs. O'Keefe. Grade nines, listen up. The annual Take Our Kids to Work Day will take place on Wednesday, November 2nd. Over 250,000 grade nine students from across Canada will be taking part in this career exploration activity. Spend the day with the parent, relative, neighbor, or a family friend learning about the skills required in the world of work. All grade nine students are required to fill in and return the consent forms to your period one teacher prior to the November 1st deadline. Thanks for Mr. Felice. There will be a diversity club meeting today after school in room 328. New members are welcome. There will also be a Gale Pride meeting today after school in room 301. The game club meeting will take place today after school in room 337 and the Chackers Computer Club will be meeting today after school in room 308. Also after school today, the grade 9 yoga session will take place. Please meet in the wellness studio, room 117 by 2.40 p.m. Thanks from Mrs. McHugh. Club meetings will also take place tomorrow. All LIT members will be meeting after school tomorrow in the chapel to plan more LIT activities for the CHS community. There will be a 
Cathedral Concert Band Meeting tomorrow after school in room 114. Any new students who play a band instrument are welcome to attend. Thank you for Mr. Walker. Also, there will be a French club meeting tomorrow after school at 2.40 in the library. Merci for Madame Sully. The 2016 yearbooks have arrived and will be distributed this Friday. You will only receive a yearbook if you have paid your $40 activity fee. If you haven't paid your activity fee and would like to get your yearbook, please bring your activity fee to the main office as soon as possible. And speaking of as soon as possible, if you'd like to participate in the Cathedral Chicago trip, you must see Mr. Walker ASAP. The trip is filling up quickly, so please don't delay. There are approximately 12 spots left, and an information letter for your parents will be going out before the end of this week. Thank you from Mr. Walker. Mr. Trabuco would like to thank all of the students who applied to be a part of the CHS TV News crew. All students who have handed in a CHS TV News application form are asked to attend a very brief meeting today after school in room 103. The meeting will be short, but it's very important that all of those who applied attend. If you cannot make it, please find Mr. Trabuco sometime today. There will be a wrestling training session today after school. Please meet in the gymnasium at 2.45 and bring appropriate workout clothing and running shoes. Thanks from Coach Ruyu. And lastly, the Cathedral Boys baseball team play their quarter-final playoff game today at 2.30 versus the Bishop Ryan Celtics. The team bus leaves Cathedral at 1.30 p.m. Good luck, boys. And those are all of your announcements for today, Cathedral. Have a great day, Gales, and thanks for watching. If we bump into each other on a crowded street, it's not us no more, it's just you and me. We're just strangers in peace.